Hello, welcome, I am Ellie, and this is one of the new circus -y sets for Lego Friends in my head, I just keep thinking of it as the one with the spinny thing, but no, its actual name is Magical Acrobatics. Woo! <laughs> so they're not just acrobatics, they are magical acrobatics! Right, so there are 223 pieces in here, it's RRP is $33 here in Australia, and inside I have a crumpled sticker sheet! Not an auspicious start, but we shall soldier on! I shall move past the crumpled sticker sheet, because all the bright colours of the Lego pieces will make me happy! Okay, so, alright, instructions, we got, ooh, okay, Olivia is in the second bag, so we will nick her out of there so we can have a look at her at the beginning, but first up in the first bag is Stella, and we've already seen Stella in ee, the magical, whatever it's called, roller coaster set, magical fun fair roller coaster, uh, the big one, the big set, so she was in there and she's wearing the same outfit, however, the printing on this version here that I've got in this set is not looking quite as schmick as the one in the first set that I had her leg leg printing is a bit weird looking but all in all I just love the fact that we've got some new prints for mini dolls so I'm not gonna harp on it too much so we got Stella and we also have got Olivia as I mentioned before because I saw it in the book and I knew because I saw her on the cover too Olivia has got a brand new outfit for this theme she's got her signature pink colored well, the sh whatever shade of pink that is, pants, but she's wearing boots with uh, with club marks up the front, which sounds dodgy, but yeah, with, you know, like cards. And her top, she's got overalls, she's got super shiny patterns on her shirt underneath, printing going all the way around the back, can see the little shiny bits on the back, and the, uh, what do you call those things, the braces that she's wearing, I think she's supposed to be a clown, and her, she's got face paint on like feathery face paint and there's another club like smack bang in the middle of her uh not quite her forehead her top of her nose bridge heading <laughs> up to her forehead ah oh, so brand new everything apart from hair for olivia it's not an overly versatile face print but oh my gosh i just love that it's new and it's something a bit different and speaking of something a bit different a brand new show pony in the new horse mold that we've been seeing recently but with a braid that goes down around the horse's shoulder is that what we call it quite that's so cool that you can actually still move the head and the braid doesn't get in the way i love it and black with white spots she i think it's a she is just gorgeous up uh, the bit in the middle doesn't have any white spots on it which would have been nice but you can't have everything and the horse has got a top hat completely decked out ready for show ponying uh, with a ribbon as well so <laughs> got a ribbon got a top hat on all of the accessories all of the time. I mean, <laughs> why not accessorize if you've got the places to put them? Now this is, oh, okay, this is bent, bent stickery bit. This is a little seaty kind of thing on the, I have no idea, oh, I can't get this bit off without an actual brick separator. I have no idea what you call this bit that connects the horse to a carriage or to whatever this horse is gonna be carrying along behind her. Why do I not know this stuff? I feel a harness. It's a harness, right? <laughs> like, is it? I feel as though there's probably a more technical name. Okay, and flags going on either side because this is supposed to be absolutely spectacular and and the, and the flags just make it extra spectacular. Spectacular, spectacular. Okay, this at the moment looks just a little bit whacked because <laughs> at the moment the passenger is just floating in the air, but I promise that more things will be attached behind this horse in the moment, but we've got to build this first. So I don't know what we're doing here, but we do have a very shiny holographic sticker in the middle of whatever we're doing here, which currently looks like a speed bump. A pink and white speed bump in the middle of the road. Maybe this is the circus version of the speed bump to slow down the horses. Because those horses have been going too fast. They've been doing drag races at night. So we need some speed bumps. Some horse speed bumps. Uh, <laughs> I cracked myself up. Okay, that's concerning. This looks like maybe a, a jumping ovary thing for the horse. This is going in there. And now I don't know what's going on. Now we're building inwards like this. Now it's definitely, oh, I don't know. It could still be a jumpy ovary thing for the horse. Uh, no, it's not. Oh, 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 okay. So we've got some gold rings in there. 
Now this is going to go on this end. This is the spinny thing. One of the two spinny things that this set includes. There are two different ways to spin in this set. I mean, if one way wasn't enough just to give you motion sickness, <laughs> then two ways is awesome. Double the fun. So this goes in here, plugs up to here, and now our spinny thing, number one, is complete. And so we attach our mini doll to here and her hair comes off. And if we turn this, it's highly unexciting because she just, she just kind of flops around. Oh, hold on! No, she does, she does actually do a full circle up around in the air if you go fast enough. Have a look at this. So, look at that. So, the friction, if you go slow, she just stays hanging down. But if you do it faster, she actually flips all the way around. I did not expect that to happen. I expected this to be totally underwhelming because I didn't understand how you could have hoops on a rod and actually make it flip. But it's the friction of the fact that you've got a uh, the flat surface on the round <laughs> of the rod that she's actually attached to, if that makes any sense. I hope it does. Okay, water bottle is on there. You don't have, well, I mean, I like to understand why things happen. <laughs> I hope I explained it a little bit. <laughs> I don't know that I did. All right, speaking of spinny things, here is spinny thing number two, which have got these big yellow bracelets. We've already seen these before, they're not bracelets. We've already seen these before in the, 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 the roller coaster set for the spinny thing that was in that. Gosh, this is just a season of spinny things. Spinny things and cool horses. So this, oh, I just love how beautifully balanced it is. Look at that. I could watch that all day like a perpetual motion machine. Back and forth. Stella's not getting giddy at all. She's fine with this. Just fine. I'm just going to let it go till it stops. Oh, I wonder what you would have to add to actually make this a perpetual motion. Okay, that's an idea for another time, I think. I don't even know if I have the ability to do that. Okay, we're at the end of this bag. Few spare pieces, nothing that we shouldn't have. And we're up to bag number two. We already got two spinny things. So what does number two hold? I don't know, but I'm going to keep rocking this from side to side. Okay, it stopped while I was busy getting those pieces sorted. So let's rock it again. It's so nicely balanced. Ah, okay, all right, enough, enough playing with the spinny things. We're back to building, building time. We've got two pink humps. We've got some pins, some technique pins. We got some little round hollow things, which I don't know the name of. Some more technique pins in here. And we're alternating the black and white for the Harlequin kind of look that we're seeing for quite a few of these things. <laughs> I've just broken Olivia. It's the ultimate of magic tricks. Look, I just magicked her back together again. And these are supposed to be stilts because Minnie Doll's legs don't actually, don't actually walk, so she can just hop around on those stilts, which is totally, <laughs> totally not doing it for me, but that's okay. It's a nice idea. Now, speaking of nice ideas, what on earth are we building here? I just don't know. Do we have... I mean, we've got our spinny things. We've got some random stilts. Got oh, that's glow in the dark. That little dot on the top. Oh, we're plugging so many things in here, and I have no idea what it is. It's gonna be <gasps> the other sets have got magic tricks. Does this one? No, this one's called magical acrobatics. Why are we putting wheels on here? So I don't think that this is an actual magic trick, though. It's a bit magical that we've got some wheels hidden in here. And this is looking a lot like. What we just built already? Is this like a mirror image to the other side that we just built? We got a glow in the dark dot on the top. Putting the little plugs in here. Putting some wheels on. Ah, so this goes together like that. We've kind of made a little truck. Like a little dolly. Uh, like, you know, a moving dolly. Not like a dolly with, you know, like, like a toy dolly. I suppose it is a toy dolly. Okay, <laughs> I digress. I'm broken now. There's a ladder on the back. We've got the little ball joint thing there to attach the horse, the horse carriage to it. So this is to transport the big spinny thing, the big wheel spinny thing around. Because mm, they obviously need to take it from, oh, well, they, they must, it must be a traveling show, traveling circus, because you've got to go from town to town. Otherwise, I, I, it's a bit hard to make money if you're just in one place. This is something that I don't know what it is. It looks like just it's pretty. We're putting some more glow in the dark dots on here, some stars on here. It just looks like a sign. Got a big pinwheel. And we've got two of these, so they actually are just decoration for the outside of our little dolly here. Oh, 
Oh, okay. So this goes in. <gasps> the wheels make it. So the wheels actually touch the spinny yellow thing and make it turn when the wheels turn when you drive it around. I did not expect that. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know why I didn't expect that, but that's really cool. Oh my gosh, right. Let's take this for a ride. <gasps> wow. And she goes all the way around when it goes oh, forwards and backwards. I love the mechanics of this. This is very clever. This is, I'm actually, I'm really enjoying these circus sets because, because they've got magic tricks and just things that you never expected to see in them. Oh, all right, and obviously you can put too many dolls in here. The ladder so that you can unload the spinny thing, see? And roll it away and then roll it back again. <laughs> it before it rolls off the table because that's the sort of kind person I am that's awesome oh my gosh all right I really love this set and I was not expecting to be overwhelmed when I started building it it's had so much more in it than I expected it to have oh nice work Lego all right that's it we're at the end of the build subscribe like leave me a comment let me think, let me know what you thought about the spinny things and and yeah i'll see you with more stuff really soon <laughs> bye